Hey guys, Deviator here. I recently created this starter kit for a UFO game. So far, it's pretty basic. You can fly the ship around, you can perform a boost, and you can shoot some rockets. It's nothing too exciting, but I'd like to add to it and kind of see where it goes. I've recently received a lot of messages asking, you know, hey, how did you set up this, or how would I go about adding this to the game? So I thought I would make a video um, just showing you guys how to add some stuff. One thing that a lot of people commented on were the rockets. Right now you can see when you shoot them, they're not too exciting. They go through walls and they don't even explode. So I thought for the first thing we would set those up. So if you open up the rocket blueprint, it's called UFO Rocket Test, you can see that we have a blank event graph. So what we want to do is detect when we hit something and then we're going to create an explosion. So in order to do that we're going to use an event called event hit. This is going to detect when we actually collide with something. Uh, and then when we hit something we want to spawn a particle system so we're going to use spawn emitter at location. And we want to get the exact location of where we hit so we're going to come off of hit here and we're going to choose break hit result and we want the actual impact point of where we hit we'll plug that in to our emitter and for our emitter template we're just going to use P explosion um, so if you were to run this right now it wouldn't work because we're, we don't have the collision set so if you come over to the components tab here you can see on our blueprint we have a static mesh and we have this sphere component we're going to use the sphere as our collision we're going to come down here to collision we're going to change that to block all and then we will just compile and save and if you come back into our game here you can see now when we shoot the rockets when they hit something they spawn an explosion however you can see that the rockets actually are still on screen so we need to get rid of those so we'll come back into our blueprint and after spawn emitter at location we're going to choose destroy actor and we're just going to leave the target as ourself what this is going to do is it's going to destroy the whole blueprint so we'll compile and save we'll go back into our game and now when we shoot we have rockets that explode and the mesh no longer sticks around. Um, if anybody has any ideas of things they'd like to see added to the this game, just uh, send me a message and let me know. I plan on adding a bunch more stuff here in the future, so thanks for checking it out.